Maria, congratulations through to the fourth round, your equal best effort here at the Australian Open. You are yet to drop a set. How are you feeling on court at the moment? Feeling pretty good. I mean, not dropping a set in three matches, I guess it's quite decent. <laughs> um, you know, enjoying myself, enjoying this crowd. I mean, it's, I mentioned it in my, on my previous match, it's like playing at home, so it feels great to be here. Tell us more about that. Clearly some fans over in that corner for you. This is like your home slam, as you say. What does that mean when you come out on court preparing to play here in Melbourne? Uh, I feel like I have, um, you know, extra strength uh, when I have them with me because, you know, they support me no matter what. And I think they're, you know, opponents don't like it, but <laughs> I do like it. So it's, um, I'm really enjoying and I really want to thank them and, uh, I mean, not only the Greeks, but everyone who's coming out here. Are you the sort of player that looks ahead to your next matchup? Sorry, I didn't hear the... Are you the sort of player that looks ahead to your next round? Do you know who you're going to play? I think I do know, yes. Jessica Pagula. Yes. Played a couple of times, uh -huh. won both. Did I play twice or once? I think twice. You, you probably know more than me, but the computer, twice. the internet says twice. Okay. You've beaten her before. <laughs> what do you expect? What are your expectations potentially moving through to the quarters? I mean, Jess is uh, a very, very good player. She had an extremely good season uh, last year. She's a very dangerous opponent. And, you know, we're both in the second week of uh, the Australian Open. So I think we're both going to try our best and enjoy our time here. And whoever plays better, you know, uh, is going to win. How far can this crowd take you here? All the way. Yeah. There you go. Through to the fourth round. We'll see you there. Thank well you. played. Thank you. Well, a confident young lady, and why not? I like uh, that Fitzy. Yeah, she's all a, the way. She's a sweetheart too, and uh, <laughs> loves the Greek support she's got here in Melbourne. And and uh, she's a chance. She's a sneaky chance. She does play Jessica Pakula in the next round. And uh, guess what? She's in the quarterfinal of Naomi Osaka and won Ashley Barty. So. They both have to get through their third round matches, of course. Have a possibility of playing in the round of 16. Sakari, Sakari, I should say, plays Gula. And uh, we'll get a semi finalist out of that lot at some stage. So a lot of tennis to be played, but Maria Sakari is definitely in the mix here.